First of all, uh, I was a huge proponent of Medicare Part E. And I believe that when you are successful in doing something for less money than you planned, that you ought to continue doing it. And if we have an 87 percentile approval rating of what we're doing, we ought to leave it alone. We, we have to find a new way to furnish health care to uh, the masses of Americans, particularly the 40,000 or 40 million plus that do not have it. Uh, by removing the employer from being part of the solution, I, th I don't think that's a great idea. I think what we can do in our tax policy. There were alternatives that we have discussed in, in our uh, committee. Uh, and it's, it, it also included some of Senator McCain's proposals. One was the uh, $2,500 or $5,000 tax credit for a couple, $2,500 for an individual. Uh, but that was a costly benefit. Uh, the, the, I don't know how CBO scores these things because nobody does. But the one that w was scored better was a, a tax deduction of $15,000 so that you could go out and select your own health care pro program to fit your need, make sure that you could still operate with the doctor of your choice. And it was a much less costly benefit. So if I had my choice, I'd rather have the deduction rather than the, the tax credit. But the tax credit is a good alternative if you're not going to do the deduction. Well, it depends on who wins the election. <laughs> uh, if, if John McCain wins, I'll use that as an example first. If John McCain's, we're going to have a private sector that's still very much involved in health care. Uh, and that's good. Why is it good? Because we can do it for less and we can cover more people. Now, if we go to the other side of the aisle and Obama and the Democrats are hugely successful, in this election cycle, we are going to have a universal health care program that's government run. Now, in every country that I have been to that has government run health care, the tax base to support that starts at an income tax rate of 60% or better. So if the American people, in their wisdom, decide to choose uh, a, a government-sponsored health care system, they better be ready to pay for it because it's not going to be free even though they think it's free.